Well, you missed the intro, which kind of sucks. Let me just check this is actually recording. Um, right, yeah, it is. So, hi guys, sorry about the black screen. Um, right, this is Crypt of the Necrodancer. It's a very new game to me. I only sort of discovered it yesterday. What I'm doing is I'm just basically looking through like really high rated user games on Steam. Um, I'm sorry if you can't hear me over this soundtrack, but it is pretty awesome. How loud is it? It is a little loud. I'll turn it down ever so slightly, but you know what? It's not getting turned down that much. There. Um, the soundtrack in this game is amazing. So what is this? But basically, Crypt of the Necrodancer is still in beta. You'll see placeholder art, music, sounds and levels, but don't let this stop you from delivering beatdowns to the beat. Um, press the up arrow key when you hear the sound. So, um, yeah. I'm just going to do this calibration. I swear it's getting faster. <laughs> that is messing with my eyes. I probably should have done this off camera, but this is like a first look kind of like I said, I've seen videos of it. <laughs> I can't talk. <laughs> oh my god, this game looks so easy, but I don't think it's gonna be. So Oh my god, really? Well, we'll save an exit, we'll assume it. So what's new? Um, I'll let you guys have a look. To me, there's nothing new. Um, oh wait, these are all the previous releases. Right, that's why I'm going to the next page. So, press the arrow key to move on the beat. So if... Wait, like if I spam it, that's me sort of spamming left. Right, I don't know if you can hear, but because I'm missing, uh, it doesn't jump. You have to like <laughs> go in time to the music, <laughs> which is so troll, but so cool. If I'm gonna survive this, I'll have to remember what Uncle Eli taught me. <laughs> so like, it's kind of like I don't know, DDR army. Learn that pattern, and you won't suffer so much as a scratch. So yeah, I don't know if you heard that, but she basically said like learn to move to rhythm and you won't That green guy didn't move at all. Um, this blue one just moves up and then down, so if I attack him from the side, <laughs> I'll never I can't talk. God damn it, I was my multiplier. That's why the floor changed color because I had a multiplier, so I was like constantly jumping to the beat. Um but yeah, those are just enemies. A broadsword, not as sharp as I used to, um, but I bet it can still take out three enemies in one shot. Looks like those skeletons put their hands in the air when they're about to jump. If I'm in the way when they move, it's gonna hurt. This is so tricky. I'm not even doing. Dun, dun, dun. This is a trap, by the way, when I'm jumping around, and it just fires you to the roof. <laughs> that trap is mostly harmless, See. but Eli warned me of deadlier traps. But yeah, it just pushes you. But yeah, if I don't dance, like, even, I can't, like, stay still if you're thinking that. I, like, lose my multiplier then. But anyway, this is like a roguelike game for all intensive purposes. And if you miss, obviously, like, you miss... Yeah, I'm bad at this. Ring of Charisma like lowers shop prices, which I believe this is a shop actually. Shit. Oh my god. So hard when you get out of sync. We've got six coins, I'm gonna have an apple. How awesome is that? 
<laughs> but seriously, this entire track is so cool. It's such a fun game, and like because it's a roguelike, they don't like last that long either. So to dig an attack, you just like press directions. God damn it! Freaking out! I instantly like. Oh my god! You died. Press up and down to continue. I'm gonna return to lobby. Um. So this is like, I guess, the main menu, and again, like, the th Oh, no. You know what? No, I wouldn't. But see, again, you have to move in time with a B here. Now, the reason I'm going to do this is because it helps me sort of like, yeah, get used to the game, I guess, and keep in rhythm. So what I'm going to do here is, you see the diamonds at the top, if you restart, um, I know for a fact that you lose them, so I'm going to buy a permanent health upgrade, so we always start with... I can't go in there yet. Um, so there's all these, like, different ones. Um, there's different, like, areas. We'll just go straight back in. Wait. The one with the double arrows um, increases the tempo of the song. Shit. I don't know which of these I want. A golden key, perhaps? What's the bomb key? Down and left. What? Sell one of your items? I don't really want to. So I want some armor. Um, or a compass. Arrow shows exit, not point. Oh shit! I lost my friggin' multiplier because I didn't keep dancing. So yeah, at the bottom you see a coin multiplier by three at the minute. Um, I'm sorry, my commentary sucks on this. Shit, I jumped into it. Oh my god, he's trying to move there and I'm jumping into his way. There we go. This is a boss. Um, so he's going to see you in the lobby. But this soundtrack... So, yeah, I'm going to have a little... Dig around. Shit! Right, I didn't realise I couldn't break stones. This is such a fun game, this. So red means the time's running out. Shit. I only can go near those guys when... Song ended next level. So I was going to the next level anyway. Like, how cool is this? So, broadsword attacks slightly in front, if we remember from the tutorial. Shit! And I died. See, that's what I mean. It's like, it's like super short. Um, we got one more diamond, so I am going to return to lobby. And this guy opened up the Beastmaster. Um, I'll let you train against enemies. Um, we don't need to train against enemies, to be honest. So, oh wait, we do need to spend our diamond. Hi. 
and we'll spend it on a chest. So one extra red chest per run, guaranteed. I think that's per floor. See if we can combo this entire level. But yeah, I saw a crack in the rock, so... Well, we've screwed us combo up as well. Obviously, the higher coin multiplier you get, the more gold you get. I'm gonna swap the weapon out, swap the dagger for a broadsword. Two, three, four, one, two, three, fuck, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two. Did I lose my multiplier? I must have. So there's one of the secret rooms. I'm trying to jump with the floor changes, I'm finding that's quite easier. Um, but seriously, I mean, this soundtrack. It's difficult. Oh my god, why did I do that? You don't even get time to think. And then the shopkeeper comes in with a second. So cool. Um, plus one vision range, we'll have that. So then I can actually see through walls. The secrets. I think. Anyway, song's ending. But it doesn't matter too much because we're going to the next level anyway. I don't think you get any bonus as such for. No! There was a diamond there! What's the bomb key? Oh, I don't have a bomb. Yeah, and I can't blast my way through. I saw a diamond then, it's like shimmering blue in the wall. They just kind of hold you in place. Shit. Oh my god, I'm dumb. I jumped back on the bloody spikes. Anyway, return to the lobby. So, I don't think anything in here now we can afford now. We can't. But we can like unlock the spear and stuff. So, we, we did get something out of the run. And this is a complete fresh start, by the way. So, I have no other items unlocked than what you've seen. And this song's slower. Right, let's keep this multiplier. Here we go. What do you like drop into and then you jump out of it? I didn't realize bats could attack. Nice secret room. Oh my god.
That's because I just stood still. So yeah, the blue, the green slimes don't move. It is like a roguelike, so obviously everything has a turn. God damn it. Oh my god, I jumped where it was going to go. Fuck my life, I'm bad at this game. <laughs> it's so much fun though, I'm not even like mad. How's it going? Um, I'm going to get a whip. How do I get the armor? Let's get the armor. We need some like, defensive items to appear. These items will show up in chests. There's gotta be like an achievement for not missing a single beat. So fucking difficult, and I'm sorry my commentary is probably quite shit. Gold spear, nice. I think a spear is in like an attack range of two. Yeah, see. over here. I forgot what they are. I think they give blood weapons or something. Shrine of blood. So I sacrifice all my health for a blood sword of some sort by the look of it. Uh, I'll take the chest and the torch. I probably shouldn't have gone to the Blood Shrine now because I'm like nearly dead and I'm not good at the game. Oh, with a Blood Sword, apparently I can open a box. Nine kills. Eight kills. I don't know what's going to happen. I need a key. That's like 25 coins, nice. Oh my god, I jumped into the bat. I expected the bat moving and because of the beat, I didn't have time to look. I didn't realize the bat just stood still. Oh, it might have swapped. If you watch here, I kill that one and then jump in thinking it was going to freaking walk forward and I was trying to attack then. Oh, let's go see what we can buy for a one diamond. We can buy some cheese. It restores two health. An apple restores... One, I believe. This soundtrack, though. Oh, we're no coins at all. We will have some coins now. Hopefully, I can combo this. Still got a combo going now. Dick. But look at that ninety coins just because we kept combo going. That is so good. Alright, let's go to the shop. <laughs> I don't even want to talk, I just like... I'm trying to again look for secret. 
I'm not sure what that is, that's why I skipped the beat. I don't need to use the apple. What's this? I'm not sure. I'm gonna try this. Am I dead? Oh, it's a level skip. I don't want any of these. I'll keep my spear. I'm not sure if the yellow ones perhaps have a set pattern. Dig for the golden key. So the golden key is buried somewhere. Oh my god, I got a sour sick with the bloody music then. This is a boss. Oh fuck, I lost my combo straight away. Um, I want to try and get the key because I can unlock this guy then. Oh shit, that sends me onto spikes. Why did I not see that? I just saw the money and went, ooh, that's a good idea. No, anyway, it wasn't. I'm a dick. I think you've even got to use like items in time to the beat. Oh my god. Nice. <laughs> it's a mimic. Oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. Well, there's a room here. There's the golden key. Ooh, and another shop. I'm gonna buy all of these. So a golden spear and some cheese. I'll he use the cheese to heal. And I'll try and get back to that guy as fast as I can. <laughs> Thank you. See you in the lobby. So the more of like the more stuff you unlock, the easier the game gets. Um, and now I'm. F what the? Sell one of your items. Screw you. This feels easier because the beat's quicker. Um, maybe the super sword, two damage, temporary shield, or maybe nothing. Oh my god, I missed a beat. I missed a beat which killed me. I tried dodging the fire, but I missed the beat. I like, went up to attack him and I tried moving there, but because I missed the beat, I stood still. So we've now got this Merlin unlocked. Hello. Which is. These items will show up in chests. Cool. But I am going to just go with the extra heart container. Oh, stay and spend diamonds. So yeah, there you go. If the diamonds aren't spent, it does warn you that you lose them. So we've unlocked the ring of luck. Let's try again. But like, look at this, you can just spend like five minutes just doing a dungeon. The torch is really nice. Huh. 
God damn it, I missed a beat which allowed them to put the hands up. Right, let's bomb that. God damn it. <laughs> I'm so bad at this game. No, we're not going to sell any items. I should have killed him. I didn't mean to go down the exit stairs. It's slightly confusing this because, like, it's hard to explain. Ooh, chest. But, like, down. Down, 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 down. See, like, there I press down and it attacked, which kind of throws you off. I'll use the cheese now and then pick up the scroll. So fun. But there, like, I pressed up to move. See, there I'm pressing right and now I'm pressing up. I think you guys kind of get it. I probably shouldn't be getting those. What do we buy? Might as well buy everything. Ring of Charisma, this makes this things even cheaper. Multiplier base damage and reveal dungeon minimap. Like, what a cool game this is. There's a dungeon here. There's nothing in it though. Maybe this is the boss room? Oh yeah, of course it will be, yeah. This is the gold bat. I could go to the next floor. Oh, fuck sake, I lost my combo. I'm gonna have a look round secret rooms and stuff, you know. Maybe there's one over here. Nope. Let's just go, I guess. <laughs> right. Oh, right, cool. I should have got this. See all enemies and helps with some terrain. That would have been way more useful than the golden key. Although... That's a fuck. I... I was like, that's a thinking of the name, and then I missed the beat, and he moved and killed me. Shit. What's in here? We'll get a purple chest each game, and then unlock something for one diamond, I guess. See if there's anything over at this dude's. There is. Ooh, what's this super plus two vision range? That's nice. Right, let's go. Oh, 
Apparently this game does work with your own MP3s as well. I'm just stood there then thinking about what I'm going to do next. You can't really think. What did that say? High damage after gold pickup. I hope you guys can hear this music alright. Shrine of Peace? Holy fuck, my HP's high now. Yeah, I'm kind of getting a feel for where the secret rooms are. They're kind of like the black bits of the map. Like in between rooms, it looks like. Shit. Like there might have been one. God. I don't know if you guys saw the diamond then sparkling in that rock. This makes secret rooms fairly easy to find, I feel. Wow, this feels fast now. Wait, this map at the bottom right, is this everywhere I've been? <gasps> I think it is. Let's just go to next level. armor. And I might as well get a glass spear. I don't know enough. One coin shot. Are you serious? I'll see where the boss room is. Do I go back and get the glass sword? Yeah, why not? This is so difficult. So this spear has a chance of breaking into a glass shard, which can't do any less damage. You see it? That's oh, even weirder now because I can't even. I can't even like look at the friggin' jumping to keep the beat. Anyway, here's the boss room. I knew I didn't lose my combo then. Fucking hell. Oh my god, I didn't see the stairs. Oh yeah, I'm not affected by traps. Right, let's get the hell out of here. This soundtrack.
I'll leave those guys in there. High damage after gold pickup. Um, I'm gonna get these. Shit. Oh my god, I jump back up in front of the dragon. I panic. <laughs> it's so bad because you don't get time to think. Oh my god. I'm so dumb. More golden auto gold pickup. Let's get those. And let's go back for another adventure. I don't know how you like have your own music. Oh, custom music. The thing is, this is just gonna get like. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna have to like. Do this. I'm probably just gonna have to use these off camera. Um, there's mods. What else have we got? That's getting friggin' boosted up. Reassign controls. There's not that many controls. There's different combos which are a little. No. Anyway, here you go. Enjoy the music. me at all. Oh my god. I'm even worse. Such a bee. Ring of gold is pretty cool. Here we go, we've got it now. So apparently, like, even just doing a failed action. Alright, let's go. I'll keep the broadsword. Shrine of glass? Oh, it just gave me glass weapons and a glass shovel. It's not that great because they can break, as I've said. Oh wait, can we get something else? We can get some armor. We said that. So cool. <laughs> I love it. Yep, here's the boss room.
That's when you hear as many friggin' like soundtracks so this is possible. Cheaper shops and star health. No, actually I want that. I'd rather get more gold. Wait, I can see a thing over here, which is probably going to be a diamond, maybe. Oh shit. This is just because I'm going to dance. Fuck it again. <laughs> there we go. I don't want any of these. What the heck? My weapon just broke completely. I needed to, I guess, jump off and pick them back up. I didn't know that. Oh well. Hello. Yeah, we'll get a whip. Right, anyway guys, this has been our first look at um, Crypt of the Necro Dancer, I really call it. It's such a fun little game. Um, definitely check it out. You've got like, your daily challenges, you've got a hardcore mode. Um, like seeded runs, so I could share a seed with you guys. What's in here? Janitor. Oh, I get to remove items? Oh, I see. See, yeah, this game is going to be awesome. Um, I'm enjoying it already. It's definitely worth it. It's 33% off at the minute as well. But yeah, guys, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like. Um, yeah, let me know. What do you think? Are you going to be picking this game up? Um, do you like it? What do you think? Let me know.